Alright, how are you guys doing? It's your man, it's Zombie Man, coming at you with another Apex Legends guide. And today, we're going to be going over our backpack and inventory guide. And this is pretty much just going to be going over how to... What's, what's the right words here? How to maximize your inventory space. So that when a firefight breaks out, or when you are entering a kill zone, you can... You know, you're going to be using all your loot accordingly, and you're not going to have leftovers by the end of the fight. That's important. It's to not have too much of one thing and not to have too little of another. So, let's get right into it. No backpack. What are, what's our inventory going to look like with no backpack? Hopefully you are not in this situation, but I can count three games now since I've been playing Apex Legends. I've been playing since release. I can count three games now to where I've had no backpack for the entire game. And those games I've ended up with more than five kills. So, yeah. But no backpack. Three stacks of ammo. Regardless of what your secondary or primary is, I would recommend just one, one stack of your secondary, two stacks of primary, or really what's even better is to just go with, you know, all the same ammo type is double light, running a sniper like the Scout, and then R99 or 301, or even double heavy, running like a wingman sniper or a wingman spitfire, wingman assault rifle, something like that. But yes, three stacks of ammo. We're gonna have two stacks of shields, one big battery, one small battery. And then we're going to have pretty much, I guess kind of complicated here, but only two stacks of health. And what I mean by that is we have a Phoenix kit right here. We'll count this as health because it regens you full. But also if, if this is just if you're on one, no backpack. You have your big med kit and a small med kit, just carry one stack. Two med kits is better than a full stack of syringes, but a full stack of syringes is better than a one single med kit. So keep that in mind. And then always going to keep, keep enough space for one stack of arc stars, one stack of grenades, at least one stack of grenades, just so you have that utility. Let's go into backpack level one. Backpack level one, we're going to have, realistically, I would recommend only carrying one stack for your secondary. And what I mean by that is you should be using, as your secondary, you should be either using the peacekeeper or wingman as your secondary. Or even if you're in competitive play, sniper. Your sniper is going to be your secondary. That is, there's just no way around it. Sniping is your secondary. And I would recommend two stacks then. But yes, so one stack is secondary. Next, secondary and primary. Having three to two stacks of primary, this is gonna give you 160 to 240 ammo, ammunition to shoot people with. A Phoenix kit and three stacks of shields. If you don't have the Phoenix kit, get a, another stack of shields. So three stacks of shields total, or the Phoenix kit. This is when we're gonna have enough space to have a med kit and syringes, just to have that utility in play. And another stack of arc stars, stack of grenades. Backpack level two. Same thing with the am. Actually, it's the exact same with the ammunition, except we're actually gonna add one more stack to your primary. This will give you a total of 320 stacks of 320 rounds or 240 rounds if you're going with two stacks of secondary. So in total we're gonna save five slots for ammunition. Again three stacks of shield batteries if you do not have the Phoenix kit but the Phoenix kit is a fantastic utility. Two stacks of health, one med kit, one stack of syringes, and two stacks of grenades now. Two stacks of grenades. Start maximizing that uh, utility. Backpack level three. This is our late game situation when you can pretty much out macro people. When it, if you really want to play like that, like what most people would consider scummy, scummy, I don't. But it's just to uh, out resource them. You know, out macro them. You out macro them, and now put the, all put all your resources into use. Ammo is gonna stay the same. Five five uh five slots of ammunition. 
one Phoenix kit. This is where I would recommend there's just no way around it. I would at least carry one Phoenix kit in this situation, but four to five stacks of shields, you're gonna have a bunch of those. Two to three stacks of grenades, or you can swap that out with the shields because shields are gonna be OP in late game situations. And a stack of med kits and a stack of syringes. As you notice, there's not really too much heavy heavy use on the health kit and because in fights and stuff you don't really want to be healing healing your health you'd realistically only want to heal your shields and hop back into it if you take the time to heal your shields and your health what you've lost you're losing too much ground and you're not creating enough presence for your team but yes super quick video on backpack and inventory guys let me know if you guys have any questions, if anything was a little complicated, or if I can simplify it any more. But yeah, this is just a really basic guide, just because in a firefight, in mid to late game firefights, you're probably realistically going to be carrying a two to three backpack, you know, a level two or a level three backpack. And if you actually follow this, you're going to run out of all your resources at the same time which is exactly what you want. You don't want to be running out of like shield batteries and still have like like 12 med kits on you, right? That's not good. Or you don't want to be running out of ammo and still have a bunch of bunch of health to go go around. That's not good. So, yeah. Following these guides, this will maximize your presence on the battlefield. It's your man Actually, let me know what you guys want to see, if there's anything I can cover for you guys. Thank you as well to the subscribers, if you're seeing this. Thank you as well for those early subscribers, it means a lot. And there is more to come. But yeah, let me know in the comments if you guys need help with anything, if I can try and simplify anything, if I can even do some own research. Do some research for you guys. I would love to do that, but it's your man. Zombie Man is out.